Amen. Bless the name of the Lord. The Lord laid this scripture in my heart. First Timothy five and eight. It says, but if any provide not for his own and especially for those of his his own house, he hath denied the faith and is worse than an infidel. Praise God. If he doesn't provide for his house, praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He hath denied the faith and is worse than an infidel. Praise God. Glory be to God. And another familiar scripture we all know that charity starts at home and then you spread it abroad. You know, and I was really looking at that scripture and pondering that scripture. Charity starts at home and then spread it abroad. Hey man, if he doesn't provide for his own household, praise God. Hallelujah. Lord, what are you saying? And what the Lord is letting me know, praise God, those that's in the faith, those that are born again and have the Holy Ghost rich, living lively in them, praise God, they are going to take care of their home. They're going to take care of their families, praise God. They're going to take care of their family, praise God. They're not going to allow their family to go without, praise God. They're not going to withhold, praise God, from them, praise God. They're not going to do it. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. He says, hallelujah, that if you don't take care of your household, if you don't take care of your family, you're worse than an infidel. And when it said, it said charity starts at home and then you spread abroad. And what the Lord was showing me is that how can you even be in position to spread it abroad if you're not, hallelujah, spreading it at home, praise praise God. If you're not spreading it, spread it at home first, if you're in the faith, if you're in the faith and the Holy Ghost and the Lord Jesus Christ is rich and alive in you, praise God, it's an automatic thing you're automatically doing for your household. You're automatically, hallelujah, it's an automatic thing. So therefore, hallelujah, God said it's going to come at automatic. That's how they're able to spread it abroad because it's, it's a given. It's second nature, praise God. It's second nature to do for your household. When you're in the faith, when you're in the will of God, when you're in right standing with God, praise God. It's it's not, praise God, something that you have to think about. It's something that you have to pray about, rather to do for your household, rather to do for your loved ones, praise God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. How can you go out, amen, and try to rescue the world, praise God, when your household is sick? How in the world can you, hallelujah, go and lay hands on the sick, amen, and pray and claim and proclaim over others' lives when you haven't prayed and proclaimed over your household, when you haven't laid hands on your own sons and daughters, when you haven't, hallelujah, prophesied over your own sons and daughters. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. When your house is sick, how can you be out, amen, saving the world? But he says, charity starts at home and then you spread it abroad. Amen. And we're, we are to go. Amen. We are to go and spread it abroad. He said, go ye into all the world, praise God, and preach, amen, this gospel, praise God. So therefore, he letting me know, praise God, and I know for a fact, those that are born again with the love rich in their heart, their household is not going lack, amen, their household is not going without, hallelujah. Charity has already started at home, praise God. That's why I'm able to go out and spread it abroad, hallelujah. That's why I'm able, hallelujah, to pour out into others, praise God, how I'm able to give into others' lives because I've already started at home, praise God. He said, charity starts at home. Don't leave your loved ones behind, praise God. Don't be so caught up in having a name and making a name for yourself and going preaching to thousands and thousands and thousands, praise God, and your house is lacking, praise God, and your house is left and your children praise God, are left behind. But God is saying, get it right, praise God. Get it right, hallelujah. God has an order, and we have to follow the order of God. God is a God of order, praise God. God is a God of order, hallelujah, glory be to God. And God is saying, start at home, praise God. Start chastising them at home. Start teaching them at home. Then you can go out and teach others. But how are you out teaching others when you're not even teaching your own home, praise God. I love you, praise God. And may heaven forever smile upon you, praise God. Don't leave your home behind, praise God. Don't leave your loved ones behind. I love you, may heaven forever smile upon you. It's my prayer.